the lineup. I'm Megan McDonald. We are halfway through conference season, and man, do we have a big weekend coming up. Huge matchup on the men's side. It's New Mexico State hosting Grand Canyon. It just so happens to be one of our games of the week as well. Two teams tied for first place in the WAC standings, both at 6-1. and one. The last time these two guys saw each other, the Lopes prevailed down in Phoenix, but this time, Grand Canyon will not have that home court advantage. GCU coming off being upset just last week for Seattle U, most likely looking to get back into that win column, while New Mexico State will seek revenge for what you could also say was an upset when the Lopes beat them, considering they haven't dropped a conference game in years and are defending WAC champions. Keep an eye on GCU's Joshua Braun and New Mexico State's Pascal Siakam. Braun is the top scorer, while Siakam is right behind him in second in the WAC. But Siakam is the top rebounder and the only player in the conference averaging a double-double with nearly 12 and a half boards per game. Siakam has been selected as one of the 10 watchlist finalists for the 2016 Carl Malone Power Forward of the Year Award just today to add a few more accolades to the sophomore's playing career. The winner of this game takes sole possession of first place in the WAC heading into the stretch of the season. So many storylines for this game. Can't wait to see how it turns out. Other key matchups, we have to talk about Seattle U coming off such a great week with a win at Grand Canyon, arguably one of the toughest arenas to play in in the country. The Red Hawks on a three game winning streak and they're back home for homecoming no less as they take on Chicago State. The Cougars who are still looking for their first win in conference play. Later in the weekend, Seattle U hosts UMKC. The Rears are coming off a win over Chicago State, but are only 2-5 in whack play. So we'll see if the Red Hawks can keep up this momentum in the second half of conference season. Big time games on the women's side as well. We have number two taking on number three in the WAC standings. It's UTRGV traveling to Grand Canyon. The Vaqueros looking to rebound after dropping their last two, while the Lopes quite the opposite on a two game winning streak, looking to gain more momentum down the stretch of conference season. GCU's Courtney Hayes is definitely someone to look out for. She ran her assist total to 158 on the season last week, surpassing the Grand Canyon record for assists in a single season and she still has seven regular games remaining. Pretty impressive for the senior guard, but Hayes will have her hands full with this UTRGV team. The Vaqueros have the best scoring defense in the conference, holding opponents only 58 points per game on 35% shooting, while Shantae Goff also leads the WAC in scoring at nearly 15 points per game. Check out what UTRGV head coach Larry Tidwell had to say this week about the matchup. Uh, we go down to Grand Canyon and Trent Bay, and his kids are probably playing as good as New Mexico State right now they've they've been on fire so it's going to be a good matchup for us and uh, we hope we play well. And then there was one the New Mexico State women the only team in the WAC that is still undefeated in conference play 7-0 on a nine game win streak the Aggies are really starting to show their dominance but road games are never easy and they travel to Utah Valley this week. The Wolverines currently lead the league in shooting percentage averaging 41 percent on the season so we'll see how this one plays out. Be sure to log in because this game is our women's game of the week. As I mentioned earlier, two Game of the Weeks this week. On the men's side, it's New Mexico State hosting Grand Canyon. And on the women's side, it's New Mexico State traveling to Utah Valley. But those aren't the only games on the WAC Digital Network that you can stream live. So take a look at the full schedule. Eight games total, that includes both Game of the Weeks. On the men's side, UTRGV hosts Utah Valley. And then Utah Valley travels to New Mexico State. And CSU Bakersfield hosts Grand Canyon. In women's hoops, Bakersfield takes on UMKC. Grand Canyon hosts New Mexico State. And then the runners travel to Chicago State, all live on the WAC Digital Network. Those games you can find at WACsports.com slash live. For more information, check us out at WACsports.com or follow us on Twitter and Facebook.